So we all go through ups and downs, right? We all have periods in our time in life where things get better, things get worse. We go forward, we go backwards. It's gonna happen. No matter what we're talking about, no matter who you are, this has happened to you, right? But here's the real problem, especially when I, I'm specifically talking more about fitness-related goals now, whether that be weight loss, increasing your total in powerlifting, bodybuilding goals, whatever, all right? We have a tendency to always compare ourselves to old old selves, right? Like like where we used to be in the past, times when we were in a better spot, whether that be physically, mentally, anything. And when we do this, we 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 really struggle to continue to push forward. Because here's what happens. We we always think about, well, I used to be so much better at this. I, I used to be so much farther along, and now I'm not. And it's very defeating. Like, the biggest problem that everyone seems to have is, is just they quit. Like, everyone's always quitting all the time. And a big part of that is just because it, it seems like it's not working. It seems too hard. And we're just so hard on ourselves mentally. We, always, we just beat ourselves down to the point where we get so uncomfortable that it just makes it easier to handle if we quit. And it's something we really got to get away from. But if you're always chasing and comparing to an old self, it's going to minimize any accomplishments that you make along the way. And it's, it's just so important to appreciate progress from your current state, no matter where you are right now. Any progress forward, you have to enjoy it. You have to appreciate it. And I say this to someone who wouldn't, like if, if, you, if you look at my, my powerlifting journey, I have gone backwards a lot. And even though that's not what I'm doing now, I had many times where I had to start over and I had to basically start fresh and try to chase where I used to be. And initially that's what I did. Like I'd always think, well, gosh, I used to, I had a 520 pound squat and like, I don't think I'll ever get there again. And, or I, I, I used to have this total and I can't get back there now. And it just seems so hard. But when I switched my focus from comparing myself to an old me to appreciating progress on a day-to-day, week-to-week, month-to-month basis, my training got so much more fun and I enjoyed it so much more and the process became so much better that I got better results because of it. So yeah, maybe I squatted 520 in the past, but whatever. Last week I squatted 365 for triples. This week I did 370. Awesome, all right, I, I'm seeing progress. I'm doing better. It feels good. I'm excited about it. I'm excited about the progress that I'm making now, but if I had not done that, if I had just looked back to the past me and compared myself to that, I would have been miserable, I would not have enjoyed the process, I would have felt like a failure, it would have beat me down, and this is what you're doing, and this is what I'm trying to urge you to get away from. Do not compare yourself to an old you. That person's gone. I don't even know that person. <laughs> that person is gone. Now all you can do is focus on the person that you are looking at in front of a mirror and just know that you are trying to better yourself now. You are trying to make improvements. And if you are making improvements, if you are making progress, you need to celebrate every li little tiny moment and every achievement and accomplishment along the way because they matter because that means that you are still trying, that you are putting forth the effort and you are getting better. And the only way to get back to where you were is through consistent improvement. And if you beat yourself down and if you feel miserable all the time, all you're going to do is quit. So please don't do that anymore. All right. Hopefully that helps. But if you have anything you want to talk about, any questions, anything at all, drop them in the comments below and I will see you guys later. Addicted to the love that you're giving Every minute, every day I've been craving